first of all, sorry about this. I need to uh, change the language to English because our Spanish <laughs> friends were uh, playing with this for a while. So in the meantime, you see all the different languages that we can uh, <coughs> use, right. including Dutch, of course. So, basically, welcome, and sorry about the, the hot <laughs> environment here. Uh, basically, smart interaction is simply put voice, motion, and face recognition embedded onto the TV with the help of built in camera and a microphone and our uh, voice motion engines. Okay? So, let me show you how I can activate voice control and use basic TV controls, and even using uh, the smart TV application. Okay. Hi TV. So just by saying hi TV, it's a trigger word for activating the voice command. When you say hi TV, the voice command bar here appears on the screen, and all you need to do is read the command as it is written on the, on the command bar. Hi TV. Channel up. Channel up. Channel down, volume up, volume up, channel number, channel 64, channel 72. So you can move up and down the channels by saying channel up and down, but if you have like thousand channels at home, you need, you, all you need to say is just the channel number and it will directly go to the channel. Uh, more commands. So obviously there are also additional commands that, that is hidden and they're mostly uh, our smart TV application including the web browser. Web browser. And without even touching your remote, you can directly go to the go to your smart TV application. And right now, Web browser it was being activated with my voice. Okay. And in the web browser, it is very simple to use the motion control and navigate through the web browser. How do you activate the motion control? Very simple. You just have to hold your hold up your hand like this, gently wave, and it will pick up the cursor on the screen, which is working just like a PC mouse. Okay. So you can select the web links, you can move down the Web page, move up the web page, and let's say, let's click. Don't forget, tomorrow is Valentine's Day. Okay. If you squeeze your hand like this, it means click or select. Very simple. Oops. And if you draw a counterclockwise circle like this, it will go back to the previous page. It means return. And you can also use these menu buttons here as well. You can enhance the, the web page size. Okay. And okay. if you click the, the search window here, um, you can do the voice search. There's, there's, there's two uh, functions for voice search. You have, uh, you can use the voice search with just your voice without using the remote, or you can use this, our premium remote control that will be included in our 7 and 8 series, okay? This also has embedded a voice control as well. And right now our voice control with your voice um, is in beta version, because it's, it's getting updated, updated. And so we could recommend you to use the remote control uh, when you do the voice search. So let me show you how it's done. Just press the voice button here. Whitney Houston. So she just passed away yesterday. And basically it will give you the web search results. <coughs> and <coughs> And there's also 
the interesting feature called face recognition. Hi TV, Smart Hub. So, what it does is, okay, I have my Samsung account, which is uh, connected with also my Facebook account, my Twitter account, and all I need to do is uh, activate the face recognition mode, and it will recognize my face, and it will log into my account automatically. And of course, you need to register your face first. TV, Hi, TV, log in. Pop off the face recognition mode. Hello. New faces. <laughs> so basically, it's designed to recognize up to five faces from uh, four meter distance. So if you have you know, register your faces, your family members sitting in, your, in the couch, and you can select uh, whichever couch you want to log into. You can use the motion just like this. So I'm a registered user, and I am going into my account. Hi, TV. Exit. Uh, you can also use the motion control uh, with the TV, basic TV control so just by waving your hand like this. You see the cursor on the screen? Gently squeeze. You can change the volumes. You can change the channel. And by holding your fist like this, it will quickly scan through the channels. And there's also you can also adjust the TV menus. Let's change the sound mode. Really. The standard. It's very intuitive. And you can also turn off the TV, of course, with your voice. Hi, TV. TV power off. Okay. Seconds. Let me change the language. 